Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's the Scorpion. It's early Sunday morning, 4.30 to be exact, and I'm making this YouTube video. The reason why I'm making this video is because 2010 is heavily on my brain. In 2009, even though this year is not over, we have made a big impact. In 2010, I want this show to make a bigger impact. And I feel it. I just feel it. I just know that it's going to happen. But what I want to know from you guys is, what would you love to see more of on The Scorpion Show in 2010? And what would you love to see less of on The Scorpion Show in 2010? My goal for 2010 is to be more in control of The Scorpion Show. I'm already in control of The Scorpion Show, but I'm not in control of the direction of The Scorpion Show. I'm not sure if it makes sense to you, but it definitely makes sense to me because The Scorpion Show has evolved on its own and it makes its own changes. But I want to be the pilot. I want to be the captain of the ship. I want it to go in the direction the way I want it to go. So The Scorpion Show may be less entertainment based. Not five days a week with entertainment topics. Maybe five days a week with real life stories, real life situations, you know, advice, relationships advice. You know, it don't even have to be relationship advice. I just feel that the Scorpion Show is going to just change. It's going to be bigger, better, and we're going to impact more people. This year, 22,000 subscribers. 24 million YouTube video views, and the year is not over. We still have 24, day, excuse me, 25 days left in this year. We have 25 days left, 25 more days left to make a bigger impact in 2009, but I know that 2010 is going to be a big impact. I don't know, I just feel it. It's the spirit in me. I just know it. So, um, you know, I'm ready to take over. Not saying take over YouTube. I'm just ready to just, you know, impact lives. You know, I just, oh, I could just talk forever. But I'm not going to talk forever. Um, the Scorpion Show, I'm so grateful. You know, doing this with Mikkel, so much fun. The Skype phone calls, so much fun. Blog TV, meeting you guys. I can go on and on and on, but I will refrain. I'm going to save all of that for our year-end review of 2009. But, you know, I'm still going to keep this video up. You can always leave suggestions on this video. Um, I'm open to suggestions, you know. Um, would you like to see more collaborations with other YouTubers? Do you want us to do more skits? I'm definitely going to be doing the real life situations. That's something that I feel I had to do. I know you guys don't like it, but I have to do it. I have to. If we have younger people watching The Scorpion Show, I had to get your attention on the real life situations that's going on. Things that as a team, you know, I really didn't care about, but now I do care about. And it's better to try to impact you now while you're young. So, yes, we have a very high young audience rate. I pay attention. And we even have people in their 40s, 50s, and 60s watching. So I want to try to cater to everybody. I want the Scorpion Show to cater to everybody. And, you know, hopefully we get a larger male demographic because right now it's more female than male. So, you know, I really can't wait. And also, my mother's YouTube channel will be coming. You know, she's itching. I know she's itching to get on YouTube. So it's coming. Maybe 1 1 10. It might come on that day. 1 1 10. I will let you guys know about all of that. Um, what else? Yeah, just bigger things, brighter things for the Scorpion Show. I'm speaking it because I know it's going to happen. And I'm putting it up in the air because I know it's going to come back. I know. I know it's going to happen. I just feel it. Now it's your time to leave your comments on what would you love to see on The Scorpion Show in 2010. 
and I will talk to you all later. And don't be afraid to leave negative comments. Don't be afraid. Say what's on your mind. Drop it in the comment box. Talk to y'all later.